Da, da, da. Bit more of this. Almost finished. Hmm. Well, since this now has kind of like a little charging thing, um, where did I put it? I think like right about here. There we go. Just need to wait a bit. Hmm. <laughs> and seeing my cousin was pretty good. I mean, he helped me remodel and stuff, so... I don't know, it's like something else is gonna happen. He always does this when something happens. It's weird. Anywho, the sweet power gore thing I found is pretty useful. Time to test out this machine. Don't have a name for it yet, but I guess I'll just call it the World Hopper Machine or whatever. Like in the thing. But, so using spare parts from whatever grab tech is and other things. And finally getting this legalized. That took a long time, jeez. I used an extra little few things, and uh, here we go. Time to go test it out. Just gotta position it, and that should work. Just put in some random things, because I don't know about any other dimensions right now, and... Uh... Oh, God! Are these people dead? People, guys, whatever your names are, please wake up. Oh, my... Back. Ugh, I'm getting too old for this. Ugh, you silly. Oh boy. Where's the band man? Dude, dude, chill out, man. Chill out, man. Chill out, man. Chill out. Chill out, Stanley. Uh, where, where am I? Where actually am I? I don't remember anything. Oh, uh, dear. Uh. Ugh. Oh, it's so furry. Ah, uh, get away from me. Yeah. Yeah, disgusting. Ugh, it's kind of rude. Where am I? I thought I was being put back in wherever. I don't even know at this point. Okay, everyone, give me your stories, please. Well, the majority of us were at the base, or, well, we were in a black void, and then Cassidy, Golden Freddy, took us out. Used the rebellion backup plan, apparently. Till this idiot screwed up everything. I did not do anything. That is the bull. I did not hit her. I, that is the bull. I called bull. I don't know, man. I was just put somewhere in like a dark room. My buddy Stanley here is freaking out about a bad man. I haven't been awake in like 15 years, man. All I remember is some weird battle, and then it all went black. And now I'm here. I got kicked out for being too tall to be a leprechaun. And I was supposed to go to Dead Space or whatever, but I'm back here. Where? If this is the same place I'm thinking of, the great silver floor is messing me up. Don't know what this thing is. Help me, please. Okay. So, I'll fix you up later, buddy. Just, just get some rest. Anyways, um, I guess you're all free to go do whatever. I mean, maybe not you. You're kind of the most suspicious, besides the horse. And Shrek, or whatever, leprechaun thing. I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna go find the nearest pub. I'm kinda... I, I don't want to be sober. I'm out of here. I, I guess I'll go find my friends. Come on, friend, let's go find chill spot. Dear God, why do I have to be alive again? 
Hey, hey, it is a ball. Nothing happened. It was not my fault this time. Okay, you need to explain yourself now. How did you get here and who are you? Well, my name is Twisted Wolf. I got caught by Dylan McLeod and anti Dylan McLeod. And for some reason, I was supposed to go back to wherever. I don't know, I hit my head pretty hard. Something threw me off course. I don't know what. What's that sound? I don't know. Listen here, bucko. What do you want? Why am I stuck? Just a little thing called... Paralysis. What? Your body is temporarily paralyzed. As long as I'm still holding on. How? It's easy. Just a little bit of amnesia. And a little rock to the head. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm not playing games here, Wolf. But I do need a favor now that you're here. Ugh. What? What do you need? Let's just say I'll put this in a way and it eat like you can understand. Say you get kicked out of something like McDonald's. And you can't go back because they'll recognize your face. It's like that. Except I can't show my face where I'm going. So I need to control something, and you're the only one from the specific dimension I need to go to that can take me there with enough power. What do you mean? <laughs> Listen here, Wolf. I'm going to take control, and you can't do anything about it. Oh yeah, how are you going to do that? Like this... <laughs> Uh, what? Where are we? Well, we're what? Well, we're in the conversation zone, I guess. You could call it. What do you mean? Well, you see, you're not exactly Twisted Wolf. You're a copy. In a way, it's a clone, but not exactly. What do you mean? They're basically the same thing. Correction, my friend. You see, a clone isn't a copy unless you put the right ingredients in. Or in this case, the right memories. And in this case, you're just a part of Twisted Wolf. How? I literally witnessed everything in the Dylan McClown universe. Like, why are we... Why are you... Why are you doing this? See, you're from a different timeline in that period. You're just a copy of the actual one in the usual time period. But that you're the part that's in a different time period. Get what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. I guess. Good. Because in that time period that you're that you're part of a little something of mine fell in there. And I need it. Why? You see, it's kind of a multi-dimensional problem. I have to go to many universes to find it. And this is the last one that's in a different universe. How do you know that? I know my way around. I have some friends on the inside. And... Speaking of friends on the inside, I think that friend that I'm looking for, a specific one, is within the time period you're in. So I need to go there. I have taken over many people, but not in a while. So this is going to be the first time in a while. Are you? Just give in. If you resist, you'll end up like this anyway. Oh. Time to find the shard. Sorry, not sorry. Time to find this piece. 
the shard specifically. <laughs> I believe he had it originally. But now he doesn't. I believe it was the shard that grants much power to the wielder. Well, let's head there. Uh, did I fall asleep again? That, that wasn't a dream. What hit me? And where'd the wolf thing go? Did he distract me? I need to go call the police, dear God. I sense a disturbance. Maybe I should start finding more of those time shards. Before they do. To give context, there are five shards within many different universes. I've collected three out of the five. Someone has collected one out of the five. And there's one left, which is in a different time period. In, uh, Dylan McLeod's universe. But... I took a piece of Twisted Wolf and became it, or I possessed it, so I could get it easier, easily. Bad grammar, sorry. And, um, yeah, and then it goes downhill from there, and then I pop back in here, and leave the Twisted Wolf there. And then hopefully the police don't find me again. Also... To give context to a to a to some to a clip I'm gonna put here uh, in a bit. This is what you get. Wait, what? I don't feel so good. Uh, time shard was there and death to cause him to disappear. That's all I'm gonna say. No more spoilers. It's gonna be a special movie coming. It uh, bye. Also, you better watch out, Dylan McLeod, because I'm going to steal your cheeseburgers. Okay, maybe not. I don't know. I just want to do a little skit thing. Um, and also give context to it all. So, I mean, you don't have to record yet. Because I don't want you to do much work. But all, usually I'm going to have... I'm just going to have lore tie in from other places tie into this. But it probably won't be canned for them. So yeah, uh, expect a plush tuber C thing, uh, episode 3 to come soon, starring, uh, special guests, maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll get some voices, I'm not sure, but I'm putting Whiskit, maybe Mr. M, if I have time to make them, uh, and one special character, actually two. But you'll have to wait and see who those are. Hoo hoo, hoo hoo, hoo hoo. I'd expect a main villain. Ooh. Also, do you guys like the remodel set? I like it a lot. Eee!